This is the HP Office Jet 5230 all in one printer. We're going to do the unboxing and setup of this printer. First, we're going to lay the box to the sides. And using a cutter, we cut along the tape on the box. These are the contents of the box. Once the contents of the printer have been removed, let's remove the printer from the box. Simply pull the printer using the plastic. Remove the printer from the plastic. Next, let us remove the tapes from the printer. Next, we will power up the printer. Plug the power cord that came with the printer into the wall socket and turn the printer around and plug the other end of the power cord into the back of the printer. Switch on the power at the power socket on the wall and press the power button on the printer. The printer will now power up. The language screen is the first screen that you will see once the printer is powered up. You'll notice that the wireless LED over here is blinking because it is not connected to any network. Let's select the language as English. And we'll select Singapore for the country and region. So it's recommending that we visit 123.hp.com to get the apps for smartphone, tablet or computer. Let's select manual setup. Now, we will need to install the cartridges that came with the printer. Let's do that. These are the cartridges that came with the printer. And these are setup cartridges. There's an indicator here where you can tear to remove the cartridge. So this is the black cartridge. Likewise, for the color cartridge, let's tear and remove the cartridge for the color. Next, open up the printer front cover You'll notice that there's a piece of cardboard over here. You need to remove it. Using the cartridge, you need to peel off the tape. To insert the cartridges, lift up the latch and place the cartridge in. Then you Close the latch. For the black cartridge, P 
peel off the tape and again leave out the latch place the cartridge in and close the latch once that is done close the cover once the cartridges are installed this is the message on the front panel we need to touch OK to continue next we will load paper into the input tray open the input tray as shown open up the width adjuster take a stack of paper and place it into the input tray remember to use the width adjuster finally push the input tray back into the printer and the paper is loaded once the paper is loaded let's select OK next the printer is ready to align the printer press OK as it's printing the alignment page we may want to lift out the paper output extender so this is the alignment page now it is important that we must scan this page for best print quality which is to lift the lid and place the alignment page face down on the right front corner of glass and we close the lid and for step 2 we need to press scan let's do that let's lift up the printer lid and place it face down as shown Let's close back the tree extender. Simply push it back. Now that we have placed the alignment page on the scanner glass, let's scan it. So the alignment is successful. Once the alignment page has been scanned, it will ask us to set up with the apps again to go to 123.hp.com. Let's take a look at info. We will go to advanced setup and show you how to connect this printer to your wireless network. Select wireless. Let's select our network type tips. We need to enter the password. Confirm settings. The connection is successful. You will notice that the wireless LED is now solid, indicating that it is connected to the network. Let's proceed. We will set up the web services later. We will install automatically for any printer updates. Let's continue. This printer will be used in a home for personal use. 
Once again, it is asking us to install the apps via the 123.hp.com website. So we have unboxed our printer, installed the paper as well as the cartridges and connect this printer to the wireless network. Do look out for the next video on how to download and install the full feature software so that you can print and scan.